good day. At some point in life, everybody needs some form of restoration. You may need restoration in your finances. You may need restoration in your family, in relationships, in your spiritual growth. So this will be a prayer that you can continually pray to help bring yourself to that point where you're restored and renewed. And also, it says scripturally, you call out to the great restorer, to the heavenly one, to Jesus, and he will restore you. So let's pray. We pray that we walk in faith in this prayer and that everything that we say, declare, and ask of you, Lord, we pray that we have the faith and belief that it will be received today in your name. Lord, your word says, restore to me the joy of your salvation and grant me a willing spirit to sustain me. And after you have suffered a little while, the God of all grace, who has called you to his eternal glory in Christ, will himself restore, confirm, strengthen, and establish you. Lord, those are your words. Let us always remember to honor, have strength in, and believe in your words. You told us in your word that you are going to restore us. But we have to have a willing spirit. So we come to you humbly with a willing spirit. Your word says you're going to sustain us. So we thank you ahead of time, Lord, that you have sustained us already. We believe in your word. You said we will suffer a little while. So in this midst of us waiting for this restoration, your word says we'll suffer. But you're giving us grace. So we thank you for your grace right now. God, we thank you for your eternal glory in Christ that you say in your word. And you also say you're going to restore us. You say you're going to confirm us. You're going to strengthen us and establish us, Lord. So we thank you. And we receive that right now in Jesus' name. Lord, let there be light in every area of our life that we lost light in. Give us supernatural power, Lord. We speak restoration into all of our finances. We speak restoration into our spiritual life. We speak restoration into our businesses. We speak restoration into anything that's interest in interesting in us that we are fighting for we are striving for lord we speak restoration into anything that we've lost lost hope in lord build our hope back up build our faith back up in jesus name lord give us our life back let us have our life back that the evil one has taken from us that it has tricked us with our mind and our mindset he has devoured our mind lord restore our minds back in jesus name Lord, some of us are having issues in our marriage. Lord Jesus, we please ask you to help restore our marriage. Transform our husband, our wife. Give us a new peace and a new understanding. Transform us in our marriage and let us see the things that we need to work on. And let us pray for the things that our spouse, our partner needs to work on. Lord, restore our marriages. Lord, could you please restore our spiritual growth. Lord, we know we're walking in sin. We know we have strayed from you. We know that we have things in us that need to be worked on. Lord, we are asking you that you restore us, refresh our mind, our grace. Uh, help us lean to the Holy Spirit. When our spirit is weak, Lord, restore our spirit and bring us a new light. Lord, please restore any and all financial issues that we have. Restore us to have a good mindset and wisdom when we're dealing with finances. Restore any and all times where we've lost any money because we believed in something or we gave too much faith and trust in somebody. Lord, you said we will be lenders and not borrowers. So restore our faith and our financial situations. Restore our financial situations, Lord. Lord, if it's us or anybody in our family that has an addiction, Lord, can you please restore them back to their original self? We bind that spirit of addiction and we loose the spirit of, of faithfulness and health in their lives. Lord, they cannot have that addiction anymore. We, we want them to be selfless and, and not selfish in that addiction, Lord. So we ask you to restore any and all people in our lives or ourselves that have an addiction back to ourselves, back to the person you made us to be, Lord, in Jesus' name. Lord, please help us restore our minds and our mental health, Lord. We've been in travail. We've been in trials. We've been so tired and weary, Lord, our mind. Please help us restore it. You said giving us a clean heart and a new mind, Lord. We receive that we will have this new mind and this new heart, and we will change any old ways, anything bad, Lord. Shut it off of us. Re re keep it off of us, Re. re restore the new things that we have to help us grow and and walk in faith in you, Lord. Restore our minds in Jesus' name. 
Lord, restore the relationships that we have with family members. We have some members that are lost in our family, that are wayward, that they are not, their heart is not for you, Lord. We ask that you forgive them and you restore their heart and minds, that they will turn from their wicked and weary ways and they will turn to you, Lord. Give them the spirit of humility, Lord. Restore our families back so we can be one and our families can thrive and grow together. Lord, any children that need restoration in our family that they've lost their way or they're sick or they are not admitting the things that they need to change lord restore your heart in our children they're in this wicked world and they don't have peace and they have vanity and all these other things that are driving them lord we're asking and we're pleading and we're believing that you will restore all our children back give them your heart give them the heart of you guys so they can walk the, the the straight road so they can have peace in jesus name hallelujah let our children be restored in jesus name lord there are many out there that are struggling in relationships that they have with their parents lord their mother wasn't there their father wasn't there there was rejection that went on lord we ask that their hearts be restored back so that they will change their ways we ask restoration for parents and families because Lord, we know you created a perfect way for us to have families and how the head is a father and then the mother and the children she's a protector lord we're asking for restoration that you will bring understanding between parents and their children and that they can learn to enjoy each other forgive each other and have peace the way you created it lord and that they will live in an abundance lord please repair those and restore those that have issues with their parents and parents that have issues with their children in jesus name Lord, many are struggling with health issues. Lord, please restore their hearts, their souls, their minds. Lord, from their heads, restore their the brain activity, the neurons in their brain, neurological issues, restore it in Jesus' name. Any issues going on with their their throat, their lungs, their their body in Jesus' name, restore it. Anything going on with their heart, anything going on with their appendages, legs, arms fingers anything restore it back and heal it lord anything that is happening inside the blood cells inside the heart um atrium um, ventricles anything going on lord restore it and heal it back to the form you had it when you made us in jesus name Lord, many people are sick of being sick. They are sick of being sick, lord. They are sick of being sick. Heal them and hear their prayer now, lord. In your name, as I'm speaking as your vessel, Lord, please heal these people, restore their health. Let them have the faith first off that they can be healed in Jesus' name and restore them, Lord, because our body is just vessels holding our, our spirits, Lord. So let our bodies be safe and healthy while we are on this earth. The blessing you gave us to come to this earth and to enjoy and live life, Lord. We want to live our life. So please heal and restore the health of those that are suffering and anything lord any diseases any viruses restore and heal them back to their original health in jesus name lord i command any dry bones to rise and live again in in their spiritual life i command any dry bones to rise and live again in their natural life lord i command any dry bones in their finances to live again in jesus name i command any bones that are dry and decrepit in marriage and parenting relationships in relations with their children in relationships with their friends anything that is dry and and decrepit and and not living and restored lord i ask you that you restore it in jesus name any family members that we need restoration in relationships with lord we ask that we will learn to forgive they will learn to forgive and you are restored in jesus name let anything dry that is dead, rise, and come to life that needs to be restored in Jesus' name, Lord. We ask you, we thank you, and we believe that it is done in Jesus' name. Amen. I pray that this prayer blesses you, helps you, and restores your mind and your heart and your spirit with yourself and others. And play it, replay it, and share it with those that you want to bless. And thank you, guys.